Welcome to our What's New in 2020 series. I'm Ed and I'll take you through drawings. SolidWorks 2020 delivers some powerful new productivity enhancements that make documenting your designs even faster. On a drawing, changing the sheet scale is easily accessible from the status bar, but now in SolidWorks 2020, the list of available drawing scales is customizable. The list is controlled by a text file containing the preferred scales for each standard. In SOLIDWORKS 2019, if you wanted a scale that is not on the list, it took several picks to access the sheet properties to enter the desired scale. In SOLIDWORKS 2020, it gets even easier. Now you can enter a custom scale with just two clicks. Key in the scale and hit enter. It doesn't get any easier than that. When creating a detail view, SOLIDWORKS always doubles the scale of the originating view. Now changing a specific view scale from the property manager is directly accessible, requiring fewer picks than SOLIDWORKS 2019. SOLIDWORKS 2020 introduces a new dimension type, the chain dimension. Similar to the baseline dimension, you select the start and continue to add dimensions between items of interest and SOLIDWORKS chains together a stack of dimensions. An overall dimension can also be added to define the complete stack. If dimensions are deleted from the chain, the other dimensions adjust, including the overall dimension. The chain dimension can be converted to a baseline dimension and vice versa. And now both the chain and baseline dimensions can be used in the sketch environment. Alternate position views are a great way to depict the motion of an assembly on a drawing, but previously it was limited to assembly models only. Now in SOLIDWORKS 2020, alternate position views can be created from part models as well. This is useful when you have one part that is made from another, such as a cast and machine part like this pump housing. So the drawing updates in summary. We now have all uppercase uh, and the ability to apply that to dimensions. We have a custom drawing scale accessible in less than four clicks. We have a new chain dimension tool similar to the baseline dimension and we can now apply alternate position views for parts.